everyone welcome to this week's live session today's topic is python 2021 where we discuss everything that's new with python going into the year 2021 but before we begin i'd like to thank our viewers for tuning in and actively participating in these sessions let's wait for a while for people to tune in Also, we have a dedicated team here to answer all your queries. So if you have any questions, let us know in the chat section. We'll get back to you. Alright, I see a few more of you have joined. So, this session will be about today's topic which is Python 21 and everything that's new with it. So, let us begin. First, we'll go through a quick intro to Python. Then, we will understand why Python is so popular. After that, we will see what lies ahead for Python and the developers in the year 2021. In the end, we will have a look at the current industry trends of a Python developer in the tech industry. So, without further ado, let's get started. Let's quickly go through this very concise Python intro. Python is an interpreted, high-level, interactive, and object-oriented scripting language. Python is very versatile in nature, and therefore, its applications are spread to various fields in the industry, more popularly in web development, machine learning and AI, and game development. Why Python is so immensely popular? Let us have a look. Python is easy to learn. Less time and resources are required for a beginner to learn and start implementing Python if we compare this programming language to Java or C++. Python is now called an accessible and straightforward language free of intricate guidelines or complex language syntax. Python is cross-platform. Cross-platform or platform independent is one of the programming language features that allows a developer to run intermediate code on different operating systems. Coding in cross-platform languages like Python is rising in popularity. A Python software written on a Linux system will run on Mac OS and vice versa. If the Windows PC has the Python interpreter installed, the Python program will run on the Windows PC as well. Python has hundreds of libraries. Any programming language's library is a set of pre-written reusable codes. Python's library collection is huge and allows developers to use pre-written code, saving time when developing a new program. With a freely accessible pre-written code, developers working on big projects can significantly cut down the initial development cycle. Libraries facilitate development in multiple fields like machine learning and web development. In addition to standard libraries, Python has a few specific ones, those for natural language processing and machine learning. Most of the libraries are mature. Python has excellent community support. A Python developer stuck with a piece of code should not be concerned about receiving relevant support. To start with, while most languages lack documentation, guides, and video tutorials, Python has this in abundance. Developers often collaborate with each other and attend meetups focused on Python. Stack Overflow and GitHub have a solution to almost every problem that occur while coding. Let's find out what lies ahead for Python and the developers going into the year 2021. In the last several years, Python has seen enormous growth and demand with no sign of slowing down. The programming language ranking site PYPL has ranked Python as the number one programming language with a considerable popularity gain in 2019 as well as 2020. Also, Python has surpassed Java and has become the second most popular language according to GitHub repository's contributions. Stack Overflow Developer Survey has ranked Python as the second most popular programming language, leaving Java behind. 
Python still has a chance to go further up in ranking this year. Python saw a 50% growth last year according to GitHub Octoverse. Most of the older and mainstream programming languages have stable or download traction. Also, Python is an exception here and has an increasingly upward trending during the last five years as clear from Google Trends. It is evident that interesting times lie ahead of Python developers with Python being the most preferred language in various fields now and in the near future at least. Currently, the stable version of Python is 3.9. Python 3.10 is in active development and the beta version is pegged to release in May 2021. The timeline below illustrates the Python development and release cycle. Some highlight features of the upcoming Python 3.10 are Frequency of 1 in the binary representation A new method, bit underscore count, will be introduced that will return the number of 1s present in the binary representation of an integer number. Zipping will be stricter. A new optional keyword argument strict will be added to the zip function. If you pass strict is equal to true, the iterables that you are zipping must be of equal length or else a value error will be raised. Read-only views of dictionaries. In Python 3.10, all the return views from the dictionary methods will have an additional attribute called mapping that will return a read-only proxy of the mapping. Removal of some backward compatibilities. The alias support for the abstract base classes of the collections module will be dropped from Python 3.10 onwards. Machine learning is probably the most popular field in the tech industry right now. Python, because of its variety of libraries, is the preferred language for performing machine learning tasks. Libraries like NumPy, Pandas, TensorFlow are widely used in machine learning and artificial intelligence. So, if you are into machine learning and artificial intelligence, Python should be the one you choose. Now, Let's look at the industry trends. The main use cases of Python in the industry are data science, artificial intelligence and machine learning, web development, and business application development. Software engineers with Python skills are offered better salaries across the globe. An average Python developer salary in India is 7,55,497 ,00 rupees. Whereas an average Python developer salary in the US is $79,395. Wow, there you go. By now, you must be aware of what lies ahead going into the next year as a Python developer and are ready to keep working on getting better at Python. We also have a Python YouTube playlist that covers everything from the very basics to advanced Python concepts. Don't forget to check that out if you are interested in Python development. The link is added in the description. And with that, we've reached the end of this video. Hope you liked it. Think we missed anything important? Let us know in the live chat or in the comment section below if you're watching it later. Thank you so much for watching this video and stay tuned for more from Simply Learn.